Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to answer the $27.7 billion question. What is Slack? Slack was created as a messaging app for businesses, but it can also be used to communicate with others for non-business use cases. I'm sure some of you have used Slack in the past to organize group conversations such as study groups, book clubs, bridal party communication, the list can go on. But for businesses, Slack is a one-stop shop for all employees to collaborate, communicate, and leverage all of the company's digital tools in one centralized location. Slack provides organized spaces such as channels and direct messaging that allows users an easy way to navigate to the information they need. Here you can see that there's a channels and a direct message on this sidebar. I've added this Salesforce training channel, but the other two channels come out of the box. Unlike email chains and siloed conversations, Slack provides users the ability to see the entire picture in one space. Slack essentially replaces email communication. For example, if your company is working on a specific project, that project can have a designated channel where all the communication and files related to that project are stored and visible to all members of that channel. Channel-based communication is significantly better than email communication. Slack is also searchable. So at the top here, users can search and easily access information across your company's various channels. I'll dive deeper into channels in a later video, but one of the unique things about channels are they can be shared with an external organization via Slack Connect, which allows an easy way to collaborate with stakeholders outside of your company on any project. There are so many awesome features that a company can leverage with Slack that if I went over all of them in one video, it could go on for hours. I'll be creating videos around the various features and topics that will help you learn the platform and hopefully will make you better prepared for taking the Slack certified admin exam. That's all I have for this video. Make sure you check out my Slack admin mini course playlist to start learning Slack today. If you found this video helpful, I'd appreciate if you gave it a like. And if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, subscribe to get notified for future videos I put out. Thank you all for watching today, and I'll see you in the next video.